The Roman Republic, 509 to 27 BCE. Rome was now run by patricians, a ruling class. They sought to expand Rome's influence, first in Italy and later throughout the Mediterranean. There followed a struggle between the patricians and the plebeians, who were the ordinary people, which led to the writing of a legal code and to plebeian influence in government. This forced the backbone of the Republic. Seeking protection from attack, the Romans entered a series of wars that, by 270 BCE, gave them control of most of Italy. Rome soon clashed with Carthage over trade in the Mediterranean. The Punic Wars lasted for 60 years. During this period, the Carthaginian Emperor Hannibal led his army across the Alps to invade Italy. After a series of victories by Hannibal, the brilliant Roman general Scipio set off to Africa to attack Carthage. This forced Hannibal back to Carthage, where he was finally defeated by Scipio. The Romans soon established new cities, building order and prosperity and giving conquered peoples a form of Roman citizenship if they cooperated. By 44 BCE, the Romans ruled Spain, France, Europe uh, south of the Danube, Anatolia, and northern Africa, dominating the Mediterranean. In less than 200 years, the Romans had become the controlling force in the West. In 100 BCE, friction grew between the patricians and the plebeians. The army was opened up to landless citizens, who were rewarded for their services with land and status in the colonies. Power struggles between generals ended in civil war, and in 44 BCE, Julius Caesar became dictator for life. Armed Republicans assassinated him, and the Republic soon ended.